Hello viewers. Welcome to today's video. In today's video, I will be showing you how you can create an Apple provisioning profile. You will be required to upload your Apple provisioning profile to your Clip My Deals dashboard so that we can build an iOS app for you. There is nothing to worry though, it is very simple. We have a step-by-step -step guide on how you can do that on your Clip My Deals documentation page. Link will be in the description box below. In this video, I will be creating a provisioning profile by following the same guide. So, let's get started. First, let's go to the Clip My Deals documentation page and open this guide. As you can see you will need a couple of things for creating your provisioning profile. You will require your Apple developer account. If you don't already have one, you will have to create a new one. Please note that you will have to pay an annual fee for the same. Secondly, you will need a certificate signing request. We got you covered for this one though. Just click on the link provided in the documentation to download this file. With that out of the way, let's begin. First up, click on this link. It will take you to the Apple Developer Account Login page. You need to log in here or create a new account, if you do not have an account. I already have an account, so I will log in. After logging in, you will be greeted by this dashboard. Click on Certificates, Identifiers and Profiles from the sidebar. Now click on the Add button here to create a new certificate. Here you need to click on Apple Distribution from the options available. Then click Continue. Here you will have to upload the certificate signing request file that you downloaded earlier. Click on Choose File here and select the file that you downloaded. Then click on Continue. Your certificate is now ready. Click on All Certificates here to go back to the Certificates, Identifiers and Profiles page. This time, click on Identifiers from the left sidebar. Click on the Add button next to the header here to create a new identifier. Select App ID from the options available and click on Continue. Select the identifier type as app and click on continue. It will take you to this page. Here, you can add a description. This is just for internal purposes though. It will not be shown anywhere on the app. For now, let's say demo profile. Make sure explicit is selected here. Then add a bundle ID here. Bundle ID is nothing but your domain name in the reverse order. For example, if your domain is ios.example12584.com, then you will enter it as com.example12584.ios. After entering the bundle ID, scroll down a little and enable push notifications by clicking here. Please note that, even if you do not intend to use push notifications for your app, we need this enabled for successfully building your app. Also make sure to tick sign in with Apple and access to Wi-Fi information. Click on Continue and then click on Register. Your identifier has been created. Now, click on All Identifiers to go back to Certificates, Identifiers and Profiles. This time, click on Profiles. Click on the Add button next to the header here to create a new profile. Select App Store under the Distribution section here. Then click on Continue. From this drop-down, select the identifier that you had created in the previous step. Then click on Continue. Then select the certificate that you created in the very first step from here. Then click on Continue. Here, you can give a name to your provisioning profile and click on Generate. That's it. Your provisioning profile has been created. Just download it from here. This is the file, which you need to upload to your Clip My Deals dashboard while submitting a request for building your iOS app. That's all for this video. For more such tutorials, please subscribe to our channel.